it's it was I didn't put a lot of work into this you can tell that eh so I showed my page and that one's done so um, we're going moving on to the alphabetical folders that you know I've been like I said I've been trying to really keep up with uh, all of the projects that I'm involved with this year there's a lot going on in my life and I am trying to stay committed this year to completing it all complete yes uh, exactly um, there's a lot of things that I just you know I have good intentions you know in the beginning of the year I have good intentions and they fall by the wayside and nothing gets done you know and then I just sit and watch you uh, you streams all day or YouTube's or you know watch other people create and I have created nothing complete love that name that, that that's love that word that's the one I need because I never complete anything even last year's Didi's last year um, what did she call it the, the little, those little folders um, I didn't I, I've not completed them it drives me crazy you know you start these things and even for the paid classes like oh my goodness you're paying for these classes and you don't complete them like hello <laughs> stop talking about me <laughs> watching others art yes I do I love it <laughs> life happens yes it does and um, I think it's called lazy lazy I'm in my recliner holding my laptop it's called lazy <laughs> so anyways we'll get back to how busy I've been really I have been this week um, my blue folder is done. I have nothing blue inside, but I did use my, um, uh, what do you call that? Tim Holt stapler, you know what I'm, tiny attacher, um, to attach my blue, uh, paint chips. And we were supposed to do doors, correct? I did mine like this. And I used one of my, uh, masks and put the bricks in. And on the other side, I just, <laughs> I'm doing it quick. I you just use the back side of, of the um, calendar, like Dee Dee did. But inside, I do have all those doors, and they're gorgeous. This one I love. Look at that. I like this one too. Actually, isn't it, isn't it a crying shame that I cut up a 2013 calendar? That's the only thing I could find. This isn't my cup of tea anyway to hang up in my kitchen. So, I wouldn't hang this kind of a calendar up. I really like this. <laughs> Can you see that, you guys? It's just, I really like it. No shame, yeah. Yeah, and this one I really like too, and I'm sure Dee Dee would love this one. That might be gifted to her yet, I'm not sure. We'll see. This one, I'm just bypassing it. The purple door. Knock, knock, who's there? Purple door. Uh -huh. I'm not too fond of this one, but hey, who knows? I could change. <laughs> now, this is the kind of house I'd love. I would love this house. Forget the door. I love the door, but I love the house. It's beautiful. I live in a rental. Maybe that's why I love houses. But this one here, I so adored because it reminds me of us having our own home and me coming out to this little getaway place to do all of my, all of my art. I just love this. I sound Canadian Albert and Albertan. Love it. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I I really dream of having an outside studio someday, but not in our winter weather. Not in our winter weather. Well, you know, this is okay, but it's like Christmas. Uh, 
Eh, whatever. And I just threw a whole bunch of paint in the back. I don't know what I'm doing yet on the insides, but call it ready. Now the one I spent time on was birds because I love them. This is my bird one. Now this is one of those one of those ones that I just had to do the I've got the pocket in the in the front. Can you guys see okay? Maybe I should um, put it out a little bit here. I keep thinking I'm way that's a little better, hey? Okay. Yeah, somewhere away from bugs. I hear um, down east in the States, uh, they have lots of bugs. But we don't hear so much. So I've got some bird um, napkins. And I love this bird. I got it off the internet and I love this bird. And I started working it in a page but mm, I don't know I'm not I don't know if I like it we'll see I'll have to see what I can do with it need something and then I've just got tissue more tissue tissue is my I just pet pet, pet the tissue now you know it's my it's my lovely thing birds that's what this is right birds and uh, back here I had these so I thought oh you know I've got so much digital scrapbook stuff it's unbelievable so you know I'm just printing 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 and printing and printing these are on cards though and I was thinking maybe ATCs but you know I started thinking measurements and like you guys are you guys really freaked out if you get don't get the right measurement like three and a half by what is it it's two and a half by three and a half right see these are huge these are more like mini tags this is five by three and a half so yeah, I might have to scan them back, scan them in or find them on my computer. I will and uh, resize them. And uh, ATCs. Yes, ATCs are two and a half by three and a half. I'm, am I right? So these, two and a half by three and a half. So these would be more like, these aren't even, uh, um, what you call, um, the postcard size, for heaven's sake. Three and a half by five they do not fit in my ATC storage I am anal oh yes I have one of those too and it bugs me when one doesn't fit in there yes I know what you mean however we're doing postcards as well so these aren't really even the size of a postcard so they're more like a tag in a journal or something like that so all I did was paint the edges here I don't know what I'm doing inside here yet but I did put in one of these uh, what do you call them page protector and I trimmed off the the uh, three ring thingy because it won't wouldn't fit in here right and um, I got it to fit right so that's an extra little storage thing uh, because that's the deepest pocket and that's where big stuff can go. So, my birds folder is done. Re I mean, not totally inside, but it's done and it's holding stuff. I don't think I have anything in here. No. So, that one's done. So, I have one more to do. And that's what I'm going to do right now. And that's my map. The maps. I'm trying to get it done. Trying, 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 trying hard work on this stuff to get it done and I am this is going to be haphazard and I'm ripping and tearing and gluing basically that's it so I got a few of these maps from different sources one is from uh, Tangie Baxter Tangie Baxter uh, her caravan uh, her caravan is phenomenal I love it uh, um, I just love it for all the um, stuff you can print. Um, 
art collage pages kind of and um, I love it so I do buy uh, her her stuff all the time so I'm just going to start start tearing guys I don't want these hard edges As you can see, I'm digging. I'm digging in, and once we've done this, the U stream will be over, and you guys can go and watch somebody else if you want. Okay, I'm going to do a couple sizes here. That one, this one here. Mm, yeah. It's going to take quite a bit for me to collage both sides with maps. <laughs> that's why I printed four pages and I hope that that's enough because with overlappage and you know rippage and all that we do lose a little bit. As I threw that little piece on the floor instead of my garbage can that's what I was cleaning up here last night. You would not believe how messy I work. I'd be ashamed to show you. Everyone good? How do you spell that first name? What first name? Tangi? Back oh Tangi T A N G I E. Tangi Baxter. You'll find her online, I'm telling you. Tangi Baxter. She's absolutely amazing. She's been doing um She's been on YouTube forever uh, when she was doing those those great big journal books. But uh, man, she has come in the digital world. She is top for me. I love her. Love her work. Love her ideas. She's amazing. And I got a couple of these maps from her. Uh, a couple I got from another source. That I had online, um, actually, and I'll show it to you in a minute. <laughs> it's going to age me, I think. Do I still have it there. Yeah, I can just reach it. Actually, just going to reach it. I found this in my stash when I was cleaning. It says, "Welcome to your vintage glue book." Copyright 2010, Mary Green. Your vintage glue book online class. Okay. Uh -huh. That's three years ago. Here's the, all the instructions. And then I got all of this from her. So papers and papers. And, you know, I printed it all out so that you could see. Like, it just never ends. And you will not believe what's in here. It's just, I found maps. Like, it's great. I love it. And look at the strips. Like, who wouldn't want to use those as, um, uh, what do you call them? Washi tapes. Those are awesome. Look at that one. I, I love it. I'm an image nut. So, <laughs> images, images will have to look beautiful. Yes. <clears throat> and she is at, if she's still there, her website is greenpaper.typepad.com. Um... So it's greenpaper.typepad.com. I don't know if she still exists or whatever. Here's a music sheet. And then she gave me all these all these images. You can do whatever you want with this, with the images that she sent. Her terms of use are this. You can do whatever you want with her images. You just cannot sell them as a collage. And that makes sense. So... I mean, this is just for myself. Here's those maps. But I, I got them darker. See what I mean? That's North America. Yeah, it's this one. I took it into Photoshop and darkened it up because I thought that was a bit too light. So, um, yeah. I found these and I found all. These are awesome too. 
and like it's just amazing so that's what i do i'm an image freak 